Hey folks, welcome back to the You Want Pizzazz channel. Today, you're gonna be learning how to create a simple rolling credits in After Effects. It's really easy to do. Let's jump right into it. Go ahead and open up After Effects. And then we're gonna create a new composition, 1920 by 1080, 24 frames per second is fine. Depending on how long you want the duration to be, you can always adjust this later, but I'm gonna go with one minute and press okay. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to right click in the composition and hit new solid to create just a black background here. Press okay. Then the next thing I'm gonna do is click the type tool here and then click in the center of the screen. And we are going to copy and paste the credits into here. Now, if you're not sure about the order of credits that are typically used in a film, I have them in the description if you wanna copy and paste that and use that as a base, but it's probably best to have all the titles filled in before you paste it. So get that all ready and then go ahead and copy and paste all the titles here like that. Something that you should know is that if you select the text layer and you hit P on your keyboard, you can adjust the positioning just like this. So don't worry about not having enough room, just adjust when needed. I'm going to select Command A in order to highlight all of them. For PC users, that is Control A, and then you can go over to the character panel. If you don't see it here, go to Window, and then open up the character panel like that. You can go ahead and change the font here. You can change the boldness. You can change a bunch of things like that. I think I'm going to make the title a bold. 35 pixels. And then I'm going to make it all caps like this. You can also adjust the spacing like this if you want a little more room. And then I'm going to go at the top here and then hit enter to go to the next line. And then this is where I'm gonna put my name. So I'm just gonna put Jane Doe, and then I'm going to adjust this to make it different because you want the titles to be different than the names. I'm gonna take away the caps. I'm gonna make this regular, and I'm gonna make this smaller. That looks good to me. Then I'm gonna copy the Jane Doe, Command C, and then I'm going to paste this under each name. And then obviously you're gonna change each name to whatever it needs to be. And then just move the positioning to move it down. This will save you from going in and changing the font manually each one. So that's why I do titles first and then name second. I promise you that it will save you time. Once you're happy with that, you wanna make sure that it's centered perfectly on the screen here. I'm just going to use the positioning here to just make sure that it's centered right in the middle here. Once you're happy with that, start at the beginning of the timeline and then you want to change the position so that it's completely off the screen. It's going to come from the bottom just like this. You're going to make a keyframe and then you're going to move it to wherever you want to. For now, let's just do 30 seconds here and then I'm going to move this up. So basically you're animating it from point A to point B. Just like that. And then you want it to be completely off the screen. And then go ahead and hit play to see how you like the speed. I think that looks fine to me. Obviously if you want to make it faster, you can move this in. If you want to make this slower, you can move this out. You can go ahead and right click, go to composition settings and change the length of the duration if you find that one minute is too long or too short. And then obviously you might wanna to add to this template. I might not have covered every single base that you need to cover, so just use this as a basis and then add to it. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please give this video a like and subscribe to the You Want Pizzazz channel for more videos. I hope you have a fantastic day, folks, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.